Hey guys, what is up? My name's Nick and today I'm bringing you another YouTube video. In this video, it's going to be a bit different from the rest because I will be doing my very first tutorial. I haven't done one before, so let's see how it turns out. Alright, so the first thing you're going to want to do is download IR Fan View. I'll leave a link in the description, but there's a 32-bit download right here, but I'm going to download the 64-bit one. The download link will be just down a little bit, then click download now. Double click it when it runs, and hit yes. And then I'm going to close out of this because the volume is playing. But anyways, click for all users if you want it for all. I'm going to change my directory to my hard drive. If I can find it. Okay, then just hit next when you're ready. Next again, next again, and then I put it in the normal folder because I don't want it in the percent app data. Then I'm unchecking the return to the home page and hitting done. Now with this open, I'll be right back. All right, the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do when you get in here is click on options, properties and settings, go to browsing, and then uncheck this. If you don't, you might accidentally scroll and lose all of your data. Hit okay when you're ready, then hit image, create new, and we're going to be changing the background color first. So click on a custom color, it doesn't matter which one. And then choose, uh, we're going to choose the ocean biome as our back color. So it looks like it's 0, 0, and 112. Hit OK again once you're ready. And then now let's change the pixels. So each pixel is a 2x2 two two area of code so let's change this to 1650 by 1275 hit okay when you're ready and then I'm gonna maximize this real quick now hit edit show paint dialog click on the paintbrush and then choose your custom color which will be the biome that we're gonna be choosing and again I'll leave this file in the description so we're going to be using a beach biome, which is 250, um, what was the other color, 222 by 85. And then you can draw all you want, scribble, whatever, but the, any of the area that you see is yellow, it will be a beach biome. But instead, I think I'm just going to open up a file that I drew earlier today and just scan it through the computer and then I'll be editing that. Alright, so this is the image I drew and I'll be right back when it's finished. Alright, so this is the finished map. Um, a bunch of these colors are a bunch of just ISL biomes. So what you're going to do now is click Save As you're going to make sure its name is map. And you also need to make sure that it is PNG, nothing else. If it's something else, then this won't work. Um, ignore everything up here uh, and just hit save. So once that's done, you can close out of it. It doesn't really matter. Um, and then we're going to drag it into our terrain control folder. So just follow along. Um, this is where you'll put the file. Uh, as you can see, it's already here, so I'm just going to get rid of this. But you're going to need to open up the world config and scroll down a little. Make sure you change this to say from image. Once that's done, you can save it and close out of it. And then go back and start your server. This might take a while. I have a bit of a ton of plugins, so... Um, now just hit start, and I'll be right back after this. Okay, so this is what it looks like in-game. Um, or I guess in Dynamap, but it'll look kind of like this in-game. So... You can see each of the biomes are what they are, or what they look like. Um, some of the other colors that you've seen were actually just ISL biomes, so they'll spawn inside 
whatever biome it is, but let's t take a look at the 3D view real quick. So this is what it will look like in 3D, and you guys can just watch the rest. Now that that's done, I wanted to let you guys know that I haven't really been posting many videos lately because I've been working on schoolwork, but now that school's out, I do have time to make this one tutorial. I haven't also been posting a lot because I haven't received many comments. Uh, I just feel like it's mostly just my family watching it, so I haven't really posted much more. But if you like what I do and you want to see more, please leave a comment down below. That's it for now. See you next time.